Capricorn, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to another Love Bite. Capricorn, let's see what's the message here for you today. And a warm welcome back to all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. Capricorn Spirit, what does Capricorn need to know? Uh, seven of Cups in reverse, okay. Judgment in reverse. Oh, and the Four of Cups. Somebody really wants to take action towards a person who they feel is, I mean, beyond compare. There's a lot of love here. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. So, I guess you guys are not talking to each other right now. But they have made up their mind. Even though they've made up their mind, they know who they want. They are not sure whether they're going to get a second chance now. This person is very discontent. They're missing their person. They've put their person up on such a high pedestal. They do want to take action. but And it's like they don't want anyone else. This person is ready for commitment. Except I think either they are the silence between the two of you or they are not clear about what the other person wants or that is a lack of clarity as to how to maybe come go forward i think this person actually wants to apologize they want to give a love offer they're ready for commitment so let's see what's going to happen i'm going to of course clarify these cards for you capricorn let's see if you guys could say something to each other what that would be and then i'll clarify these capricorn and their person spirit if they could say something to each other now what would that be let's take a few more capricorn from another deck Capricorn and that person spirit if they could say something to each other now what would that be just a few more Capricorn from a third deck as well and then we'll start the reading Capricorn and that person spirit all right good to go let's start the reading Capricorn and uh, if any of you're looking for uh, personal readings my email is omkara taro at gmail.com you can reach me there it's there in the description box below as well so the first card here says i know you think you broke me but don't give yourself so much credit i'm not porcelain i might have a few cracks but i light the let the light in and i allowed it to shine back into the world don't worry about fixing me so much as you should worry about fixing yourself yeah, that's spoken like somebody who knows what they want and they have it all. I mean, this person is not, um, they, they are so fulfilled within their own life that they're not chasing anyone. This, is, this could be the person saying, hey, you know what? I can feel your frustration with you not being able to express yourself to me. You're overthinking things too much. Perhaps you could consider writing things down to get some thoughts flowing on paper to clear your head. Yeah, somebody's scared to speak their truth. They want to take action. They can't take, take their eyes off this person. But it's like, how do I make this work? I get so frustrated by the intense telepathy, the dreams and the strong sexual energy, even though I'm alone. Your hunger and desire for me has me burning up, but you're nowhere to be found. The passion is an all-consuming, unextinguishable fire and it's driving me crazy. I want to welcome you into my family. You are half my soul, my soul family. I want us to have our own family together. Walking away from you was the hardest thing I've ever done and it's my biggest regret. I want to hold you tight in my arms and never let you go. It breaks my heart to know that I broke your pure heart. It's really hard for me to open up. See, I told you, somebody is feeling scared of revealing their truth for some reason. Do you still love me? Do you still want to be with me? Your soul is always with me and mine is guiding you. We're always together in spirit, even though physically we may be apart. I want to take this relationship to the next level. Are you ready for that? All right. So these were some of your messages, Capricorn. If these were resonating with your storyline, let's start the reading with 
an angel blessing card and this is for the viewer the one who's been attracted to this reading so capricorn this could be for you could also be from your for your cross watcher who's um kind of found their way here trying to check on your energy so uh message guidance advice or a message there is love here there's true love here <laughs> or at least the angels love you a lot uh, capricorn and they're sending you a lot of love beautiful you got the card of love all right so now spirit tell me what's the seven of cups in reverse what's the seven of cups in reverse okay one more seven of cups One more. I think somebody made some very unwise and foolish choices here. Uh, they, I think, delayed making a choice in the past. Maybe they there's distance between the two of you people, but now they have. I think they now they've made up their mind. They want to heal this connection. They want to uh, end whatever um, conflict happened between the two of you. They want to heal that, but now they are not sure they'll get a second chance. Yeah, this person is very very upset and very angry. I think at themselves because uh, either they took the wrong judgment call or they now they feel they won't get a second chance. This person was uh, maybe they pretended you know they were not interested or maybe i don't know this person could have behaved in a manner where now they are a little scared they may not get a second chance but now they're sitting very discontent because now that there is distance between the two of you now they want they want everything they want um, uh, the ten of pentacles they're seeing the potential of a far-reaching long-lasting connection this person is going through uh, the night dark night of the soul right now they feel devastated at maybe the fact that they made the wrong choice in the past they are very discontent they feel that was a golden opportunity there was a golden cup that was offered to me and i didn't take that uh, now even if they have other options i think this person is missing that golden cup right yeah they're very unhappy they are very very unhappy they feel none of their dreams and wishes will come true or this person could be indulging in maybe alcohol or something feeling very very foolish at this time because now they are sensing that the other person has probably given up on them is exhausted of them tired of them given up on them it's making them feel very very foolish okay so now king of wands you're in the upright here so what do you want to say oh they're still they're still holding on to that hope yeah they are feeling stuck but they are kind of trying to figure out a way where they, they can transform this connection because they want to take action they uh, realize they realize that uh, in the past maybe this person was being a bit selfish maybe or they were a little stubborn or they they were insecure and they were pretending to be somebody they weren't uh, they didn't fight for this connection and they know that they are being seen as somebody who's being selfish or just thinking about themselves some bad memories could have been created now they feel that the other person has totally given up on them and that's why they are in anxiety and sleepless nights and stress and tension they feel that the other person has left them behind moved on and now there's disappointment here because they feel oh my god all that i did in the past all my behavior it kind of backfired on me here because now from afar when they look at that person they see them as everything that they ever want this person they could be very uh, you know uh, doing really well in their life maybe or not chasing them or attracting good things into their life it's like they can't they can't find anyone else to compare this person with and the more they see uh, the more they feel bad that uh, their person may not even be waiting for an offer from them anymore they could have moved on already i mean who wouldn't want a person like that it's it makes them feel the lack of courage right just the thought that maybe the door is shut now maybe my person doesn't even want will not let me in and that's kind of burdening this person they're feeling worried they're feeling overwhelmed they're feeling um, uh, i don't know how to make this work now so three of uh, pentacles in reverse three of pentacles in reverse spirit yes this person is kind of even though they don't know how to make this work or i don't know they still want to fight for this connection from what i feel yeah they want to rebuild this person definitely wants to rebuild they want to heal this connection i think this person could even be ready for commitment now uh, hierophant 
high refund but they're not sure if the other person is because the other person is not really messaging them, talking to them. They feel that the person whose love they took for granted, who was always giving them a lot of love, may not want to, them in their life anymore. It's like, what if they've given up on me? Why? Because I think there's silence. I think you guys are not really talking and that's making them feel that uh, the other person has turned their back on them. Totally because of their past behavior maybe somebody was always you know behaving like i don't care and i'm bigger and better and i do what i want and this is what i want they they are so ashamed now of the way they behaved because they know that that's what caused the ending they have shame they have remorse they have regret and uh, now a lack of clarity why ace of swords what's the ace of swords in reverse Ace of Swords. This person uh, does want to come back. This person definitely wants to come back and they do want to come. Maybe they lied. Maybe this person always... Okay, so this person lied because they wanted to see... They wanted to see if the other person would continue putting in the work. It's almost like this was a lie. This was a lie right they were they were maybe got used to the other person putting in a lot of work or doing all the work now they they are realizing that that kind of behavior actually caused a halt to the connection now they know that the only way they can come back is now with a, with an apology right so let's see what what's this apology all about see here's the, here's the page of cups again as the overall energy what's the page of cups what's the page of cups yep this person now wants to reveal their truth. They want to reveal their truth that they actually wanted or still want a long-lasting connection. This person is ready for commitment. Why did you lie then? Tell me. Uh, well, why the Ace of Swords in reverse? Why did you lie? They Okay, whatever they did, what they know that it was unfair. It was unfair. Maybe, let's see. Either they thought that person would not want to be with them or they, I don't know, maybe they thought that, that, per, that the, the other person was too good for them, too good. They, or they, they may have been wanting to make sure that there was nobody else in the other person's life. There, there was some kind of a lie or a, a miscommunication here where one person did not put in the work because either they thought the other person is too good for me or let me see if this can really happen if the the other person has somebody else in their life there was something yeah they were not sure they were either not sure which direction this connection can go or they were scared right so now now they now they want to come back but now they don't know how to make it work because now they probably have realized that this is the person i want this is my soul mate but i don't know how what to do now they could be seeing the other person as maybe also stronger than before maybe taking their power back or uh, it's not going to be easy now right to get back into the good books of the the person who they ran away from or created all this uh, or pretended that they were not interested so well that's what i have for you yeah walking away was the hardest thing it's been my biggest regret that's what i have for you till next time then love and light take care namaste capricorn